Flight attendants are demanding a tougher crackdown on air rage, saying the friendly skies are not so friendly anymore. If we continue at this rate, there may be more incidents in 2021 than in the entire history of aviation. Nearly 4,300 cases of unruly passengers have been reported this year. Air rage has unfortunately become all too common. I've lost count the times I've been insulted or threatened on a flight simply for doing my job. Most cases are mask related. Flight attendant Teddy Andrews testified on Capitol Hill Thursday about one such encounter with a passenger. He said, N word, I don't have to listen to a damn thing you say. This is a free country. I was completely taken aback. I didn't know what to say. But he continued, you heard me in word, boy. And knew this morning, another frightening encounter in the sky. Word that a man tried to storm a cockpit on a JetBlue flight from Boston to Puerto Rico while attacking the crew. The FBI says the man was yelling in Spanish and Arabic, saying he wanted to be shot and then tried to strangle a flight attendant. To stop all the chaos, the Association of Flight Attendants is urging lawmakers to bring more criminal charges against offenders and step up alcohol policy enforcement in airports. While 85 percent of the incidents are mask related, flight attendants report there are many contributing factors, the next highest being alcohol. Although unruly passengers have been fined more than a million dollars this year, the Flight Attendants Union says only one case has resulted in federal charges. Andrea Fujii, ABC News, New York.